Hey, what's up guys? Camp and Russia here. Welcome back everybody to another Fortnite video. Today we got a, a lot of news. A lot of little things, couple big things. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, touch that like button for me, and use code the Camp and Rusher in shop. I got a new hat. I'm trying to up my hat game a little bit. Honestly, I just got a new haircut and I'm uh, I'm growing into it. Alright, so you're gonna you're gonna see me with my hat on at all times for a little bit. <laughs> It's an excuse to up the hat game. I got to step it up. So uh, first thing from Fortnite here, watch your proximity. The V9.21 update lands tomorrow, June 12th. Downtime begins at 4 a.m. Eastern. So this is a not a content update. Again, we did uh, we, we do know this, right? We knew, know it's 9.21, 9.3, three content updates in a row, and then a new update on 9.4. So that's that's kind of our next month and a half of updates timeline-wise. And there's downtime tonight, so I'm probably gonna stay up and put one video. I assume there'll be some some changes, like a bunch of changes. So they have they have got some balancing work to do, of course. And then there's probably gonna be some leaks as well, some event stuff. Probably no skins. We still have a lot of skins still in the files. So uh, I, make sure you subscribe right now. Hit that sub button because I'll keep you up to date on on everything, anything that happens in, in this uh, update or any changes, any files. I'll keep you up to date. Here's the item shop. Uh, or I guess from yesterday at the time of this recording, it's the item shop and it's pretty cool. The ripple the skin or wrap is awesome. It looks super good. I believe it's animated. And then the hazard agent and toxic trooper. The reason I'm pointing out the shop is they have these free styles, these free styles, uh, free stuff. They're free. If you own the skin already, obviously you got to purchase the skin to get access, but uh, I like them. I honestly like these a lot. It's a fresh look, a back bling, and both skins. We didn't know this in my video I made on this already when the 9.2 came out. I, I I didn't know. I didn't know that both of them got an update. So I thought I'd point that out to you. Again, code the camp and rusher. I appreciate it. Send me a tweet, comment, Instagram post if you are, are rocking my rock, rocking my codes, so, so I can say thank you. Okay, and on, on top of that, you probably noticed this as well. The item this week, it's not the new pump shotgun, the bear, right? It's the uh, proximity grenade launcher. And the description, it's not a horseshoe or a hand grenade, but close still counts. So uh, you know, really that tells us that it's an explosive weapon, but we kind of knew that. And here again, just a reminder, here's the damage, or here's all the stats. Damage, fire rate, mag size is two, range is one. Reload times 2.83 seconds, 2.84, and impact is 825. Some of those I don't know what it means, but the damage you can see, 70 damage. So a lot less than the grenade launcher, but maybe a quicker fire rate, 0.65. We'll see how this thing plays out. It could be one that ticks everybody off. It always can be, right? It can go either way with these things. Next up here, again, Fortnite. Today they released a hot fix to remove the Boombo from the Team Rumble LTM. Yes, not completely. The boom bow was too powerful in this mode due to players responding with 100 HP. And and that that's it. So, uh, one of the top comments is, too powerful in that mode, question mark. Dakota actually wrote that. He's always replying, man. He's got something to say always. Not in a bad way, not in a bad way. Uh, but I, I completely agree with this. Because they said this, I think we should expect another nerf to the, the boom bow in tonight's update. All right? Uh, you guys know last week they uh, nerfed it by upping the the fire or downing the fire rate, right? The it's 1.25 seconds now before your next shot uh, compared to one second, and they said they were going to keep looking at it. So based on this, if it's still OP in Team Rumble, I mean, get rid of it or not get rid of it, but nerf it again, nerf the damage. I think they're going to nerf the damage. That's my call tonight. My bet. Make fun of me in tonight's video if I uh, if I call this one wrong. I could get it wrong, but I think that'll be one of our changes. But it's changed in the in that LTM for now. Next up, the brand new zombie LTM, the Mash LTM. This is going to be a, a player versus AI LTM. I'm actually very excited for it. We don't know that when it's uh, releasing. It could be again with the update tonight. And I have three animations in game. Uh, leaked by Fort Tori. I'm going to play all three of them for you. These are from the new LTM. Four players versus a bunch of zombies versus the horde. And there's going to be challenges that come with it, which we've already talked about. Here are the animations.
is for you. Some cool ones. And uh, on top of that, and again, it, they're not going to be in the sky. He just does it in the sky. He brings in the animation and he has to put it up there. So uh, uh, the placement doesn't matter. On top of that, last video was about the creature. And it worked out weird because I, if you watched my last video, it was a big one. The, the creature is in the water uh, beside the island and he has the whole Polar Peak castle or part of it on his back. Like it's super weird. And I didn't know, like while I was filming, we were talking about the, the leaks, the potential, like putting some files together and saying that's what's gonna happen. And then I, as I was editing the video, there was footage released of the, the creature swimming around the, the island. So it happened as I was editing. So I, I grabbed the clip I threw it in the video, even though I didn't fully talk about the clip, uh, I threw it in there because it, it happened perfectly. And then I was able to, to get that uploaded for you guys right away. And so I thought, but the video was kind of crummy. It wasn't too good when I first, uh, when it first leaked. I have a much higher quality video here, footage of the, the monster with the, the, the castle on his back, whatever it is, uh, floating around the island. So here's a, not really an update, but higher quality. How big is this thing, man? What's under the water? I think that's what's everyone, what everyone's asking. And again, with tonight's update, I think that's going to be one of the big things is event leaks. I think there's got to be some event files added, and that's why it is a 2.1 rather than a, a 9.2 content update because that's when there's no downtime and no new files. That's kind of the difference between those two things. The only other hint or whatever that we have of the uh, of the monster is this uh, week five loading screen from season nine here in the background that top left you can see there's like a big shadowed head and everyone believes that's the monster as well and then you can't really make out a, a body like maybe there's like i don't know if some of this is attached to him right like there's the i don't know tentacles or something near near the face but you can't tell if they, it looks like it's part of his body and it, it from this perspective he looks big right so i don't know I, what are your guesses right now in the comment section what do you think this thing is it's obviously some type of sea creature uh but yeah take your guess down below i want to hear your thoughts i thought i'd show one more that's the only other piece that we really have about this monster to give us any more insight again we will have more tonight i can almost guarantee you next up here Donald Muster has updated his location uh, on Twitter to Party Royale. A lot of you have been asking me, what does this mean? What's going on? Uh, it's nothing too big. It's really, uh, we've, already, we've already talked about it a, a long time ago, actually. And it has to do with, with this as well. There's a new tournament in game. And again, you guys have been tweeting these all at me. That's kind of why I'm answering this one. So many people have been interested. There's a new tournament in the tournament section. And all of this has to do with the Celebrity Pro AM that's happening this weekend, or I think in the next few days, at E3. Um, and it's a roster of 50 celebrities teamed up with 50 pro gamers, creators, uh, battling for 3 million charity prize pools. So it's an event that Fortnite's hosting in real life at, at E3. And the tournament section, you're actually gonna be able to watch the gameplay live uh, while in the client, right? You're gonna click that tournament, you're gonna be able to bring it up in the client and watch. So you don't, you can't actually play in this tournament, but that tournament's gonna be used for viewing purposes. So I thought it was good to clarify all that. Couple other big things here, this one's funny. Reddit, 10,000 upvotes, a bug, a big gl a glitch bug happened, or happened and it was all the Switch players in, in the lobby got their input blocked and we all fell off the bus together. Some mobile players got some free kills out of it and there's a photo and uh yeah so i guess none of them could type anything so they were all stuck in the bus and yeah i guess 30 40 i mean i don't know how many in total but everybody was stuck in the bus 
and they couldn't do anything and then they all landed and I guess a couple because mobile and switch are together a couple mobile players came in and just uh, cleaned house right killed all the AFK guys so I, I just thought this was a, a, a funny bug funny glitch and finally uh, a big piece of news here Donald Mustard already deleted this tweet but he did post this to Twitter as a teaser for the Fortnite Battle Royale E3 event that we just discussed and it's it was this picture and uh, yeah it's spring break Peely starring Peely just kind of a, a, a joke with the with like a movie preview but in the photo there's Peely in like summer uniform so a lot of people are saying this is a teaser for uh, the next unlockable free style for the Peely skin and again I'd be a fan I, everyone's saying it though they, everyone in the comments and I agree it's like Peely's an awesome looking skin but I just don't like rocking him he's got a weird skin texture that makes it hard to play with but it's such a good skin. So I'd love for them to add a style, but I also gotta be honest, I don't know how much I would use it. What do you think about that? Do you agree, disagree, let me know. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to touch that like button on your way out. It does help. Subscribe to the channel, keep you up to date on all things Fortnite and code the camp and rusher in shop. Uh, I appreciate it. Take care, talk soon. Hope you like the new hat.